well since we posted a video. We filmed a video not probably about a month ago um, and Anthony has been trying to edit it and for the second time now he can't because one of the films are corrupted so we don't know if that video will ever go up. We've been so busy Anthony and I just recently graduated actually a week ago from today so we've been doing all this graduation stuff and we're going on vacation for a week and so we'll have videos coming soon from there. We'll have vlogs and I'm pretty sure a few challenges on the way. And if you subscribe to our channel, Moly Vlogs and Trump Monkey's channel, I'm sure that we'll probably be vlogging some and be in our challenge videos as well. So today is our first beauty, like first beauty unpackaging and my favorites of the month. Let's get into it. So I subscribed to this Ipsy packaging. It's an online thing. I don't know if you heard it. But it comes in like a bag like this. Through the mail. And it's only $10 a month. And before you get these packages, you have to answer questions like, what's your skin type? Is it combination dry, oily? All that good stuff. If you would like hair, nail, face, makeup products. And so basically you just go in and customize it your own way and they send you packages in the mail for ten dollars a month so this is the packaging for the month of may it comes in this package and this has never happened this is, i've done this for a year and a half now to, actually over two years i've been doing empty packages and it's the first time i've ever seen this on it the tissue paper but i think it's because it's a clear bag so here's what the bag looks like it's got ice cream and popsicles on it and it's very really cute like this is the first clear bag that I've gotten in over two years and so yeah it comes with five products every month and the first product we have today is some body moisturizer it smells really good and I'm always like my skin's really dry so I need all the moisturizing I can get um next we have this um eyeshadow um, if you follow me on Instagram, you have to, you can tell that I like doing eyeshadows and like trying different colors. And this month, I've been pretty into very bright, like orangey type colors. And let's try to get this open for you guys so you can see what colors it is. Okay, it's like taped up really well. And speaking of makeup, I have none on. I don't know if that it's like kind of like it's like why is she talking about makeup when she has no on? But it's okay. I can't get this open. I might have to tear the box. <laughs> One moment. I finally got it open after like five minutes of struggling. Um, it had tape on both sides and in the front, so nothing could get broken. But so pretty packaging. It's five. Pacifica, which is a, it says natural mineral eyeshadow, is 100% vegan, and it's cruelty free, which I love. I can, I really do not like brands that, you know, test on animals or all that jazz, so I love how this brand chooses to not go that route. Um, and I opened it up, and I noticed that there was a crack on this glass, or the plastic of this, but I mean, I don't know. I don't think that was for me when I was trying to open it because I didn't hear anything crack, but it's okay. But it comes with um, five shades. Um, I'm not sure. I think this is like a skinny dip, then coral sand, then golden treasure, and sandalwood. Um, this is a beautiful, beautiful little palette here. It's got all the colors you need from like the crease color all the way down to like I would put this color on the lid. Let's watch it. Whoa. <laughs> Pigment. Okay. This is very beautiful and I will use this definitely probably tomorrow. I have no plans tomorrow but I will definitely be using this tomorrow just to actually try it on. Because I've been, like I said before I even opened this, I've been doing like, like orangey goldish colors. This has both in it. I'm very excited. <laughs> Yay. That's really pretty. Okay, next 
we have this lipstick and it's got more tape on it so hopefully it doesn't take me that long this is by the company or the brand mellow oh it's not tape actually it's just plastic <sighs> and you're gonna have to speak through this So this is a lipstick. This is what the packaging looks like. It's very pretty. The color is called Polish and it is a matte lipstick. Let's see what this looks like. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh my god, I love this. It has like, oh my god, look how I just dropped it. It has mellow engraved on the sides. So pretty. I'm gonna swatch this on my hand so y'all can see the color. Wow, very creamy color. <sighs> I love it. I love those dark, kind of bronzy colors. Not bronzy, but kind of brownish colors. Mm, I don't know what this is actually. Oh, it's a bronzer and a highlighter. I've been obsessed with highlighters. I don't know who hasn't because the whole makeup community is going off about oh my gosh never mind I just remember something but the whole makeup community has just been loving highlighters I love highlighters I know a lot of people that I watch on YouTube loves highlighters and they're just very very pretty and after I do this packaging stuff um I will be Showing you my May, fav May favorites, like I said before. And it involves some pretty, pretty highlighters. I got it. Okay. Okay. So I think this is the bronzer. Let's just. It's pretty. And then here's the highlighter. Um, it's not really that pigmented at all, but it does have some shine there. I'm going to swatch it on my hand, get some more. This isn't very pigmented at all, honestly. I mean, it's probably, like, you can't, I mean, I know there's not really good lighting in here, like, at all. But, like, nothing transferred from my finger onto my hand. It's, like, not going anywhere. So I can only imagine what it would do on a brush. But, yet again, I'm not going to judge it yet until i use it with a brush and then speaking of a brush it comes with one this is from the royal i don't even want to pronounce his last name but i'm just going to show it to y'all if i if don't know how to pronounce that bless y'all because i'm but it's a precision angled brush i guess you can use it for highlighter i don't know I'm not really a, I mean, you can do a nose contour, but yeah, this is my empty package for this month. I'm really excited to try all these products out, especially the eyeshadow palette and the lipstick tomorrow. And follow me on Instagram because I'm pretty sure I will take photos of it tomorrow. And you'll see it on my Instagram. So with me today, I have six of my May favorites, um, and it's kind of everywhere, like it's some foundation, um, I have eyeshadows, and you know, just a lot of different stuff. For my first favorite of the month of May would have to be this MAC, um, four shadow palette type thing um it's called called the canyon and it has four shade four shades um like i said i've been using a lot of golden orange so that's why i really love this palette and i just yeah it's really good um i use this mainly for the lid crease crease and sometimes when i go out you know like at graduation i put this on the inner corner not in the inner corner outside corner to make it look more dramatic but it's a very good palette it was a gift so i wouldn't i don't know how to how much it is now the next thing speaking of highlighters is the wet n wild highlighting powder this stuff is so good it's it was 4.99 at walgreens
Walgreens. And I mean, the packaging isn't going to be the best because it's a drugstore brand, but that's so okay, especially when it's that pigmented. Like, you can probably see, I've been trying to work around in the same, but like, come on now. Like, it's so good and it's like really shimmery. Like, <laughs> it's like so bad, it's hard to tell, but it's like right here. But for $4.99, I was like, I have to have this, and I've heard so many things about Wet n Wild highlighters, so I decided to give it a try. So, yes, that was probably the best bargain of this whole fan favorite, fan favorite, my favorites of the May, May, month of May. And now next is foundation. This foundation came from Sephora. I bought this on their website um, from my app that I have. This is Sephora's 10-hour lasting foundation so good i know i was really skeptical about buying foundations online because i'm very pale and sometimes the foundation can be really dark on me if i think it might match or it can be really light so i was kind of hesitant on buying this but i heard really good reviews i will say that it's not really that full coverage but it does last a long day i tried it with different primers to see which ones work the best because i was running low on like both of my primers that I really like and this is it will come to it later in this video but about like benefit professional primer works amazing and it lasts for a very long time so for the hours you get for this foundation it is worth it and this was $20 um I got it on the Sephora app I'm pretty sure they have it in the store but yeah this is like the best foundation I've ever owned and I own quite a few. Now speaking of Benefit Professional, um, I recently bought, I got a sample size actually from the Ipsy packages and I got a, like I bought this from the store because I'm cheap. I got two of the small ones instead of one big one because it would be cheaper. So I did get this but I do love this because it minimizes your pores just like it says it does. And it lasts, especially like with my foundation, it lasts, it's a great match, like it matches, like lasts all day. And another lip product that I love is this Clinique's lipstick. It's, um, the color is called Bear Pop and the number is 02. This is from earlier, I'm just going to show you. It's such a pretty color and it does have shimmer in it. It has like a little shimmer, which I don't mind honestly. A lot of people don't really like shimmers in their lipstick if they're going for like a subtle look, but I love it and I don't know how much it was, but I will do research. <laughs> and last but not least, my favorite of the month and I've only used it once, but I just bought it um, the 30th actually, so like the day before May and then but it's um, Kat Von D's, like holographic palette. Um, it comes with four shades. These four shades are holographic. The packaging itself kills it. Like I love the packaging. It's so pretty. And I love how it comes with a little mirror so you can like, you know, I love holding mirrors while I get my makeup on. But I can, you can just hold your mirror. Comes with four shades. Comes with a green color, an ultraviolet color, a blue color, and a pink color. And I'm just gonna show you how pigmented these are. Like, so pigmented. Like, come on, so pretty. And like I said before, I've been into like highlighting so much. This is also, it's used for a face and eye highlighter palette and it's mainly for your eyes and when you put lipstick on for like the after like I don't know what it's called but you can put it on top of lipstick to give it a holographic look but I've been using it as highlighter and the best way to do it if you love fan brushes it works um but I find a, I have like a little brush and I just apply it very lightly. I don't go in heavy because I know how pigmented this stuff is. But I'm just going to show you. And like, 
makes my nose look purple and I know that sounds weird but I love it like I don't know there's something about it it's just so pretty and it's like I just put that way too high but it's okay we'll take it off in this minute but it's like so pretty and I love it on my Instagram yet again it is up there because I posted pictures with this because I was so in love with it but yeah that's about it for this video um if you liked it please leave a like and a comment if you want more of these videos um please subscribe if you haven't already and be aware of next coming up videos so turn on those post notifications as always until next time